Monday morning, I've never done drugs. I don't know what that's like. Just stay standing. I'll have you sit in a minute. You get to sit for the rest of the service, and I'll stand. How about that? <laughs> I, I've never been addicted to drugs, but I've heard stories about you stay on a high, and then you come down, right? Well, I, I woke up Monday morning still on that high, because there's no high like a high that the Most High can provide. <laughs> come on. Got in my car to start my day. Y'all know me and that car, we got this love-hate relationship, huh? Yes, we do. Sucker was spittering and sputtering. I bypassed the location I was headed to and just went straight to Tri-County. What's it called? Somebody, I'm trying to give the brother a plug here. Transmission. Transmission. I was going to say collision. It was going to be a collision. I'm just telling you. And my flesh was wanting to get out and just blow that thing up. But that's how, that's how the enemy works. And I just walked in. The guy, I turned my car off. The guys come out of the garage and said, start that back up. I was like, I don't even know if it will. <laughs> and I did. And I turned it back off. And I walked in the cold, handed the keys. I said, just let me know when it's done. Now, those who've been here and heard the last time that happened, I let my flesh get the best of me. Huh? Come on. Been there. But see, when you're in the presence, when you walk in the presence of God, see, the high was still there, but sometimes you got to shed off the physical high, the fleshly high. Woo, that was a good service. That's to be, ooh, that was so good. Make me feel so good. That's the flesh side of the high. The high that actually will sustain you is the high that when the world tries to throw you a low, you still stay up. Come on. You still stay up. See, that's why I said, be careful what you ask for. God, I want your presence in every area of my life. So when the devil tries to throw me a curveball, that thing, I don't see it. I don't see it coming this way. I see it coming straight ahead. I'm not scared. I'm not worried about it. It's okay. God's going to provide. It'll be all right. I'm going to stop right here because it ain't time to preach. But I just felt like somebody, I wouldn't even plan on sharing that because y'all get tired of hearing about my car. But I just want to let you know, man, when you have a great day, the enemy's always going to follow it up with, yeah, well, check out what I'm fixing to do. And I just step to the side and go, God, let's see what you can do with this. So some of you, and I'll stop right here. Some of you got something going on. Some of y'all got a this in your life. Some of y'all got something unexplainable going on. But what you need to remember, you have an indomitable hope. You have an indomitable faith. You got more inside of you than anything the enemy can throw at you. And all you need to step, just step, just step aside. Just step aside. Don't fight it. Don't play with it. Don't entertain what the enemy's trying to do with you through it. You can be seated. <laughs> How many are glad to be in the house of God this morning? Yeah. Somebody say, why did you cut it off?